guys and welcome back uh, this is a wh little weapon chat I just want to talk to you guys uh, and not do unboxing <laughs> I'm working on this beautiful art from uh, uh, Mary Manzano it's been a while I have uh, been working with her before but now I I did work with another painting yeah, a mystery painting but it I did get a little bit heck of it, to be honest. So I thought maybe I'm gonna work with it in between because it's only white background and it's not easy to work with. What is it? There are something. I'm just gonna. Okay, that's okay. We're gonna fix that. Um, I did use a ruler on this one, and then I decided not to do it anymore because it took a while to do it with a ruler. And this is the painting. It's Daughter of Honor with um, it's one of the princesses. And uh, I know that many people want them, and they are not available anymore. And yeah, I have almost everyone. I'm missing three of them. And I decided this year I want to do most of them. So I did some last year and I want to also complete some of them this year. Um, and I decided this round was kind of one thing I wanted to do now. Um, I am probably not gonna turn out on the light pad today and I'm gonna work uh, like you can see all of the painting. I'm gonna do it a little bit different. And uh, what can I say? Um, I want to do this whipping chat because uh, some people have maybe seen now that I have changed my name uh, on my channel. Uh, and reason for that is my name was so long. It's Norway Connie eighty five, so it was kind of long. And when people are kind of searching for name, they want smaller name. So I changed it out to Connie uh, 25. It's kind of my um, everyday um, user name when I am um, playing with my friends on my um, PlayStation. <laughs> so that name has stuck with me for a while. Um, I am using this big tray uh, for if there are plenty of drills and I did buy one cute uh, kind of heart um, but they were kind of uh, annoying in, in the end right here but I'm using it yeah in between uh, I also did buy some of the uh, metal uh, kind of so I used that on my new pen no it's not a new pen but it's old pen so one placer and a four placer right here i really like it and yeah so i just want to do a little bit of chat with you guys i don't know what's been up i have been sick so i have tried my best to get some painting out some unboxing and i always do um, one day that I unbox all the thing I have gotten uh, through the week. Um, let's see. Uh, I did get one new tray from my unboxing. I really love this tray. It's more stiff. And this is the tray I'm going to try to use today for smaller area with pl not plenty of drills. <sighs> yes let's see i'm not used to uh, diamond paint without the lead pad but i'm gonna try today <laughs> just for you guys um i did buy something for the princesses i have uh, something new that came up in a uh, ad on facebook uh, it was kind of like a frame, like you you could frame it, not in a, in a frame frame, but in a, uh, 
it's like a um, plastic frame that you put on your wall and it looks like frame so I decided to try that out because the one thing about those long pictures if we gonna buy some frame for it it gonna cost plenty because there are different okay the, the size of this frame you cannot get in a normal frame so you have to uh, order a custom frame uh, and that's gonna be a little bit expensive so I decided maybe to try out the other uh, thing that I did get on the ad so I went not to the ad but I went to um, I'm buying small thing at Aliexpress and I decided maybe I'm gonna try uh, try that one so I ordered like four they come in a, in a kind of roll and I want to try it out <clears throat> uh, and I'm gonna only try them out on uh, the princesses so I did uh, order like black frame for them so I'm kind of excited to try that out and maybe when I'm done with all the pictures uh, from those princesses I can show you my in my hallway it's so long that I I hope I can put all of my princesses in that wall so when you enter to my home you can see all the princesses in the hallway that's kind of my goal one day um, uh, I have been busy uh, doing plenty of thing and I am also gonna uh, do a kind of operation it's not gonna be a long time before I'm gonna leave uh, to a heart clinic and get my heart fixed because last year in uh, it's been one year maybe a little bit more than one year since I did have a, a stro stroke is it called something like that uh, and now I'm finally gonna fix it so I'm looking forward to uh, maybe not have plenty of problems I have been a little bit sick since COVID and it was not bad uh, I was only a little bit uh, sore in my throat and was yeah kind of um, normal uh, in this time of year that you get a little bit um, yeah what can I say sick so it was not terrible for me to be sick since I also have my problem and I was in the the danger zone you can say but yeah everything went well I am getting better and I have plenty of things on my plate right now so I'm trying to fix so I have been trying my best to do this channel I am so glad that so many pe new people have seen and get into my channel that's very nice and yeah I hope maybe one day I can do like um, a challenge for you guys and get some prizes out or doing something like that I've been thinking about it for a little while now um, but I have to find out which one I'm gonna do maybe maybe now at the summer time I want to do a summer 
kind of thing. I don't know if the that could be a great idea to do a summer painting kind of challenge. I want to do something for you since uh, you are so nice and joining my channel. So yeah. But yeah, it's going to be in the summertime maybe. I'm trying to th think about it. And I have been not diamond painting so much lately um, because of I have been a little bit sick or something have come up and I have to yeah I was kind of uh, working with the uh, mystery kit and the mystery kit I did work on uh, was so hard that I was kind of not enjoying it I I don't know if it, it was the square it, it was the picture I don't know but I didn't diamond paint quite much and my mom did get some paint in her hand so she was not diamond painting so I have been playing with my friends on my PlayStation uh, so I didn't have any time to diamond painting as well so I thought the easiest way for me to start my diamond painting again was to start with this kit because she is so lovely and I love working with uh, Manny Manzano and um, I don't know why but it's so easy to work with her paintings um, so it makes me like to work more. I have been done doing like one square a day just to get it up and running again. Um, I don't know if I was kind of tired uh, of diamond painting. I did need to do something else. Um, I'm not quite sure what it was. But now I ho hope I'm back for good and gonna do more like whip and chat and more diamond painting itself. Um, because I enjoy doing this channel. Uh, I don't have plenty of people but I think that's not the the thing you need to have plenty of people you need to have people that enjoy looking at your videos and I have seen that the videos that I make now it's going to the roof so that's very nice I really like that it makes me glad to see there are people watching what I'm doing so and I'm when I started, I was kind of scared because I don't like to be in a video. I don't like to, uh, since I'm Norwegian, I don't speak uh, quite a lot of English. And I was kind of scared for the English part for me since I'm Norwegian. Uh, but yeah, it seems to that I have managed that one. And I'm trying my best. If you don't understand everything I said, please send me a message. I'm trying my my best. And I also got only positive message from you. And oh, that's so nice. I really like that. Um, people trying to help me. That's very nice. Giving me advice. I love advice from you guys because I'm not a professional diamond painter or a youtuber or something like that because uh, when I did get into this I want to do it just for fun and, and try to be a little bit social of me because uh, in Norway we don't have plenty of people that diamond paint uh, so 
I think this one uh, when I do my channel it's very nice to see how many people that do diamond paint but in different kind of states and I wish there are more in Norway, Norway as well uh, but there are some uh, that know what this is and I have seen in some of the stores we do buy like books they are coming out with uh, some small kits from Diamond Dots or some other companies uh, from one of the company we have is Staples and Staples get uh, like partial Christmas diamond painting uh, but yeah I don't think that is that's nothing for me because I love like Diamond Art Club and I have plenty of good quality on their canvases uh, today was the first day I did count how many I have from only Diamond Art Club because there was someone in the group that asked people how many diamond painting you have uh, so I did find out for the first time wow I do have plenty of them and yeah I do pay every single one of them uh, and some of them is from my bonus and some some of them are cheaper for sale but yeah there are plenty of money I have buying from uh, Diamond Art Club this one uh, was a Christmas present from my mom so I also get some present and my boyfriend has helped me buy some of them I was kind of when I was down mood to do any diamond painting I was kind of maybe I should sell some of my painting I did say to my boyfriend but my boyfriend told me they are not going anywhere and you have been collecting all the painting now for yeah, two years I believe I have been doing this so um, no I don't need to discontinue no oh, what, what is it called again I uh, not discontinued but de-stashing um, and maybe it's gonna be a little bit hard since I'm from Norway and the chipping and uh, custom is oh it's terrible um, so I'm glad he said I could uh, it's not a problem for me to have all my pictures so so that's nice and my <laughs> My brother, he said, oh my God, uh, what are you going to do with all your paintings? I am going to paint, I diamond paint every one of them, but not this year. It's going to be quite a lot of years. And my mom always uh, have a problem doing them finish. And then I have to give her some of them. So they are going to be done one day. But I don't know when. Uh, are you gonna keep everyone? Uh, my brother said to me, and I said, "Yeah, maybe some of them are gonna be in like um, a present to for people, like uh, yeah, for Christmas or something like that. I I don't know. But I want to keep them all, and I." do have to have a big house to have all of the painting up on the wall but the one thing we can do with all the paintings we don't need to have everyone on the wall at the same time maybe we can have some of them like in Christmas time there are Christmas paintings there are like um, paintings for um, Halloween or something like that so I could take some of the painting down and put up all of my Christmases Halloweens and something like that so I'm not going to use everyone every single day but maybe some in the different season maybe so yeah
so that's one of my kind of thinking how I want to do it and I cannot frame everyone so that's why I am so glad I'm gonna try the new kind of framing system uh, and I hope it goes well I'm kind of scared for my walls if they gonna damage the wall because right now I am just uh, living here and paying other uh, like a landlord uh, so I don't want to ruin the painting on the wall uh, so I have to be careful because they say in my contract I don't have to I cannot stick anything to the wall if I'm gonna make something on the wall you have to use like a, um, a special kind of thing to hang the screw in the wall so yeah I'm, uh, I'm hoping it's gonna be like Tessa's um, I did frame a lot put off the frame on Tessa's right now and I think that's a great idea because that should not be damaged to the wall with knee uh, like hammering in some screw so that's a little bit nice <clears throat> and it's easy to do for me because I'm a um, I'm a girl and I'm not good to uh, use like a drill so yeah I hope it's gonna be okay I'm kind of, um, uh, with this picture, it's not that plenty of dark. Um, I believe I have two bags of black. But yeah, the other painting I have have plenty of more of black. Oh, I think this glue, or oh, the wax right here is old and not so sticky anymore. But yeah. I should use the, the the containers to have them in, but yeah, I do not use them. I am looking so forward to the summertime now. Right now we have a little bit sun outside uh, those couple of days. Uh, my mom have uh, been grilling outside and enjoying the nice sun we have but yeah it's a little bit cold uh, I wish it could be more hotter outside I went to my mom's cabin in the winter time oh my god when we did come to the cabin it was so snowy and I'm not kind of allergic to the snow because when my skin get cold I get kind of itchy so it's not nice when it's so cold outside and the nice thing about that cabin trip was I took with me some small diamond painting uh, for the kids we have uh, three kids with us and uh, we did like a family we did sit down and diamond paint together like a seasonal kind of pictures I am gonna share them with you uh, only my youngest son he wanted to take his picture with him so that's that's okay that's his so he was kind of he loved it he loved to do it and um, we're kind of excited to do it together, so that's very nice. <laughs> so yeah, I'm not gonna keep you very long. I just wanna do a little whip and chat, and so I can have something else, not only unboxing on my cello I don't know as I have not been buying so many, many more like um, I did have the the storage system right beside me and some new one but I'm not buying like pen or something like that anymore I do believe I have P 
plenty of things uh, like pens and, and other stuff so uh, I'm trying to be on my no buy list oh that's so hard um, uh, I did buy new diamond archive this weekend um, so the no buy it's quite hard to do <laughs> um, but yeah I am waiting for quite a lot now and uh, maybe it's gonna be that way for a little while um, it's nice to have something coming in because then I can do a video with you guys as well but yeah I'm trying to save up my boyfriend's gonna be 40 this year and that's a big number I don't know what the hell I'm gonna buy if, because he had everything I wanted to buy like um, he always wanted to jump out of a plane uh, and I don't, I, I'm, I'm scared for heights so I'm not gonna jump with him and then it was not like he wanted to do it by himself so then I have to find a friend he can jump with or something in, in the family but yeah it's gonna be expensive if if it's gonna be two so I don't know uh, I also want to buy him like a day on a, uh, like he could drive or a special car maybe because he loved to drive fast uh, and maybe on a track it could be more nicely for him but yeah then you have to go to like um, out of state um, so that could be a little bit hard and maybe I was thinking maybe I'm gonna buy him a weekend in Paris or something like that maybe that could be a thing um, because I always wanted to go to Paris or something like that to see the Eiffel Tower or we are very we love food very much food and we are trying plenty of restaurants here in Norway um, and we have find some restaurant we are kind of very like uh, but yeah I could uh, try some new out of state and we have not been flying for a while because we love always to go on a vacation to uh, warmer countries and um, yeah we like to try out new stuff but now since the covid did came we have not been traveling for two years now so maybe it's time to take a little vacation I do not work since I'm waiting for my operation right now and maybe it's a good idea just to get away from Norway I don't I don't know we have very nice here in Norway so I have to see maybe maybe not but yeah I have done like uh, 30 minutes of weapon chat with you oh, I'm kind of shaking you because every time I move my hand or something the tables are shaking I'm working uh, I'm always working on a tilted table I love my tilted table but I'm not tilting it for the moment but I can uh, yeah take it down or up or something like that but yeah I'm gonna stop right here and I'm gonna do something else I'm gonna do the black finish before I am closing this painting up 
and doing it a little bit later because I have some chores I have to do um, so I cannot sit here all day I did do the unboxing today so I'm gonna do other stuff right now because I've been sitting here since yeah some hours now so I am so super glad that I could do this whipping chat with you guys today and I hope you have a very nice day and hope you have fun Damon painting uh, please do not what I did I did get tired of diamond painting for a little while but yeah I'm back and I'm ready to do smaller kits I, I decided to do a little bit smaller but this one is not small but it's not big it's long and very thin it's very nice with the paper so it's like one two three squares to do so yeah so that's all for me today and hope to see you very soon bye guys mm -hmm.